Welcome to Managing Myeloma. I am Dr. Philip McCarthy. Today I'd like to discuss whether there is a benefit to providing antibiotic prophylaxis to patients being treated for multiple myeloma. In the past, patients who presented with myeloma often would have what is called immune paresis, where their normal immunoglobulins would be suppressed by the abnormal clone. And some of these patients would be at risk for developing infections uh, before they were treated or uh, during therapy. The British groups uh, in um, a randomized phase three study uh, looked at almost 1,000 patients and randomized them to either levofloxacin antibiotic prophylaxis or placebo during the first 12 weeks of induction therapy. What they found was that there was a decrease in infectious uh, complications as well as deaths in those patients who received levofloxacin when compared to placebo. And when they looked at those patients who received trimethoprim sulfamethoxazole uh, in addition for antimicrobial prophylaxis, they found an even greater benefit. So we think that this may become a new standard it's not quite part of the guidelines yet, but uh, the results are impressive uh, in abstract form, and we wait to see the manuscript to evaluate it and then determine if this will now become a new standard for those patients who are receiving induction therapy. Thank you very much for viewing this activity.